Vault Dwellers to the continuation of my Let's Build of Teffington Greenhouse and Water Plant or something. I don't know. We're going to jump right into this one and start building some fun stuff. We are actually going to be using G2M. And let's see, we're going to jump into going here. Um, maybe not there. Maybe to decoration. Where was it? Just looking at the stupid thing. Ah, here we go. I think it's in Far Harbor. Fish farm! There we go. We are going to build a fish farm. Yeah! But, before we get to that, we need um, a path to get out to where I want to go. Now, this awesome feature of G2M is we have animated floating bridges. How cool is that? So, we're going to put a little guy right here in the water. Make sure he's set where we want him. And if you watch him, he does bob up and down, sway a little bit. Really cool stuff. Um, now we need a way to get onto the bridge. So we're going to put a little guy like that. Except um, we don't really want to step into the water when we're doing that. So let's, let's bring this back here maybe. And let's see. How tall does that make it? That's not bad. I can deal with that. Um... Yeah, except I want this to go a little more straight like that. So we'll go ahead and do that, and then we'll grab this guy, reconnect him, and there we go. Now we'll start putting some more of these floaty guys in place. Uh, let's see, we got a blue one. Let's put one of these. Oop. One of those. There we go. Now we got ourselves an awesome little floating pathway. That's really cool. And... all right. So we're going to have a fish farm. And let's see. We'll do something like that. Um, maybe we'll change it. Whoop, wrong one. Let's see how it's going to connect this. Maybe we can... Oh, not quite what I'm looking for. Over here. Something like that. There we go. That's a little better. Now that looks a little more realistic. Oh, we even have some fish going in there, too. Look at that. It summons them. Uh, I didn't know it actually did that. I thought you had to spawn them, because you actually can spawn your own fish using this mod. Um, the only downside is that they swim in and out of the net. Uh, unfortunately, there's not really a whole heck of a lot that can be done about that. Um, well, let's see if they continue to do that. Uh, at least when I did my testing when I first found this. Yeah, see, they're just going, like, wherever the heck they want. Um, so, yeah. But uh, we can even spawn our own fish. We'll stick one group right there. And we'll watch them. They do kind of the same thing. Zip in and out of the net. I mean, it's a really cool animation. I just wish that the uh, mod creator had fixed something like that to make it so that they didn't do that. But, uh, you know, figures can't be choosers. So, um, you know, I want to see if I can actually fix that so they can make them go underwater a little more because they don't look like they're totally under the water, but uh, it's being a little difficult. So, I'll take the net out of the place, and we'll get these guys, if I can highlight them properly. There we go. Bring them down into the water a little, so they look like they're actually in the water. Alright, now let's snap that back into place, and there we go. Not bad. I'll, uh, I'll take it. And uh, this is assignable. I can, uh, when I start getting some, uh, some people here, actually, well, let's put a guy in here. Because, why not? Um, anyway, once we start getting settlers, we can actually assign them to this and start producing some food. So, alright, let's see. Game alterations, workshop, spawn settler. Um, let's do a random. Who cares? Yay, we have a settler. Our first settler! Alright, hope you like fish, ma'am. Okay, you. Got it. Get fish. Yay! Produces ten and makes people happy. All right, now we're cooking. Um, all right, now I got to make her a bed to keep her happy. So she's the first settler. She gets the first bed. So let's go ahead and make a bed just to just to you know. All right, which I don't know what I'm going to be doing yet, but just for now we're just going to stick a bed in here just so happy. Yay, she has a bed. No defense, because we haven't really built defenses yet. Oh, and she's in the water. 
I thought she'd be like walking up on the thing here, but um, she's like not even standing on anything. That's funny. Maybe uh, maybe we can help her. Let's um, let's put something in the water there for her. Let's go into. Uh, actually, you know what? CBC's got some pretty good stuff in the dead waste, the dead lands here. We have some. Not stumps, cliffs, piles, but rocks. Uh, not that big one. Figure something out. Give her a little something something to stand on. Let me turn that off. I'll make it look like she's actually there on something. Let me get that one. Let's see. Ooh, that one's nice and flat. Perfect. There we go. Now she's like standing on the rock. Let's get it right on her feet properly and. She just really likes the water and really likes the fish. Cool. <laughs> oh man, that's too silly. Um, let's uh, fill this in just a little more so it's not like she's gonna fall off a ledge or anything. So actually, looks like she's doing okay. All right. So, uh, in the previous episode, we worked on this bad boy. We got some electricity flowing, and uh, we got ourselves our walkways and whatnot. And I was thinking about doing the gateway there. I'm actually filming this way ahead of you guys seeing any of that and voting, so I'm not touching any of that stuff just yet. Um, bring you out. You guys are not sticking in getting my settlers. Um, so I'm not going to be doing anything of that sort in this video because I don't know what you guys want to see just yet. If you want to see me do that. So I'm going to move on to other things. We're going to leave that rock, and we're going to actually go work on the guard towers over here in the corner. So, yes, uh, in the last video I asked if you wanted to see me put a boat in the water over here, as well as do a bridge, some more um, guard towers, and some doors over there so the boats can get in and out um, into the rest of the water so they can travel downstream. I think technically this is a lake, though. Uh, let's see. Does this actually... Oh, no, this actually keeps going. Okay, no, it is a river. All right. Good thing I have God Mode enabled, or else that would have killed me right there. So, okay, let's go back over to this corner. So, I'd already come in here um, a couple episodes ago and got rid of the upper half there, and I am going to build some sort of guard tower here. I haven't even thought about what is going to go there, so let's see. We're going to use maybe CBC. And we're going to go into, hmm, let's see, that's ground, no, prefabs, let's see, what do we have in metal? Uh, let's see, all this junk stuff that I've used before and other things, I mean, you got something like that, but I don't want to use that. Um, I might use something like that for a different type of build, but not for this. Um, but we have laser gels, so I don't think we want that. Um, let's see. Could kind of sort of use something like that if I really want to, but don't. That's too big and too gaudy. And I don't really want to do something totally prefabbed either. So. That kind of. Maybe. Maybe. Um, let's see. Wood. Walls. Shacks. Hey, actually, that's pretty freaking cool looking. That uh, might change my mind now. Use one of these for the prefab. Not that guy. Whoa, no, not that. Um, hmm. No, can't use that. Right, um, let's see, what else was there? Uh, eh, Alright. Um, where was I? One of these. Um... That's actually pretty cool looking. That kind of looks like a, a guard shack. So, all right. So maybe we'll actually use one prefabbed for for this corner. And uh, the next one. Oh, we don't really have a view that way though. That's more that way. All right. So maybe we won't. Because I am still trying to keep this kind of practical, and I want to have a good view facing that way and that way. So. Having said that, let's, um, let's see, let's just maybe stick a floor here. 
and we'll start building one from scratch. Let's get that going like that. Turn off my snap so I can actually put this in place the way I want it to be. Which I haven't decided yet. Um, oops. Let's see, how's that gonna look? Down. Um, that could work. Alright, let's see what our visibility is gonna be like. We can see off this way. And we can see off that way. No, I actually do want to do some touch-ups on that one over there, but not right now, because there's. Uh, I want to add some more fortification to it, which, speaking of, I'm going to go into these bad boys here, and uh, I'm going to play around with some sandbags, sandbag walls, and stuff like that, and um, make this, like, very heavily fortified, so that if somebody starts shooting at us, we don't really have to worry, or we can duck and cover, you know? Um, let's see. Nope. Nope. Um, maybe. Yeah, that's kind of... Oh, jeez, I fell. Alright, let's just kind of stick you up there for the moment while I try to finagle myself. And, uh, we'll stick you kind of like, uh, maybe down in there. We can actually see over. And, let's see. Oh, jeez, I'm going outside. Let me turn off my... Um, timeout canceller so I can make sure that this looks good. Um, yeah, you can't really see what's going on. Alright. Um, let's see. Oh, that's too tall. Too big. Alright, so let's go back to this bad boy here. Finagle one bar, and then we have this little corner beast here. Oh, I gotta turn that around. There we go. And let's do that. Go over a little bit like that. Hey, that's pretty beastly. All right, let's uh, hippity hoppity up here. We have this little corner here that we need to protect. We'll just kind of boop, drop that in there, and there we go. Now we need some protection from the rain, so we're definitely going to be making a roof for our heads. Uh, let's see, anything here I want to use as well before I do that. Uh, let's see, well, we got all kinds of tents and, and funky piece stuff here. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. I mean, I could have just used one of these guys, but we're having fun. We're building our own little little thing here. Here's another little pre-made simple guy. Um, oh, and you actually have corner ones. I forgot all about those guys. Anyway, alright, so... Let's head into our wood structures and supports. And we're going to put a whole bunch of beams in here. Let's get one of these guys in place so I can finagle it. And let's put you there. Yeah, I'll take it. And let's... Um, come. Oh, it doesn't want to move. Okay. I don't know why I wouldn't come to me when I push the move button, so we'll just have to kind of do something here. Get you like directly in the corner. That. Perfect. Alright, need another doer here. There we go, this one finally moved on its own. And we'll take you and put you like so. And we might have to do one, yeah, we're gonna have to do one here in the back as well. And we'll also put some steps coming in and going. And, of course, we're going to need some support down here. We've got a taller one. Yes, we do. Fantastical. We have the start of another guard tower. Now, let's see. Um, we're going to need a roof. That's not a roof. That's facing the wrong way. Uh, let's see. We can put a little simple guy like this if we really wanted to. Let's put something like that in there and then fix it so that it's proper. Um, yeah, that's starting to look like a guard tower. And let's see, we will have just one ladder way. Let's turn our snap back on and maybe that'll do. And we'll do something on the ground here to make this look like it actually is in place properly. Um, 
And of course we're going to need some miscellaneous railing of some sort. So let's put... Um, hmm. Hmm. Maybe we'll go to USO. I think USO has some pretty cool ones. Uh, furniture, not to where we want to be. Go to wood and railings because there's some really cool ones in here. There we go. We got some snippy designs here. Uh, of course, we don't want to do anything with stone texture because that's just going to look unrealistic. Um, thinking, yeah, some of these metal guys here. So we'll put one there. We'll make this one a different color so that it looks a little more realistic, like they just kind of grabbed what they can grab. Now we have a new guard tower. You can see that way and that way, and we are protected. Cool. Now, for the ground, um, that's not going to do, because that just looks terrible. So, we're going to head to CVC, uh, do, 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 here, and into the Deadlands, or Deadlights. Did I miss it? Miss it. Where did I go? Oh, that's where you got to go all the way over here, tummy. Um, and we want cliffs, but not that one. That's too big. We want to put, like, a little dude like that in place, maybe. So, let's see. We don't need a whole heck of a lot. Just need to make it so that the thing connects there. Yeah, that's not bad. Let's see, what other shapes do we need? Let me put something a little different in here. Something that fits the ground a little better in this area. Um, no, that's kind of the same. We also got to fix this guy that I just covered in the last episode. Um, we will take care of that uno momento. Um, oh, we got one of these dudes. Let's see. Beach? No, we're not at the beach. Um, hmm. Hmm. No, that's not big enough. What in the world? Oh, it's a, with some dead trees. No, we don't want that. We just got rid of all the dead trees. We don't need that kind of crap. Um, let's see. Throw something in here that makes it look a little different. Makes it fit in a little better. Uh, let's see, where was that little guy? This guy here. Let's just put that like that. There we go. Now it looks a little more realistic, right? Yeah. Uh, I'll bring it back up a little bit. On the ground. Okay, cool. Um, we actually might not have to worry about that, because maybe I will stick a building here to kind of cover that, so for the moment, I'm not going to worry about it. Um, you can stay. Got a big hole in a lump there. And... All right, on to the next tower. So we're going to make this one completely different, and uh, yes, I wanted to fortify that one as well, so we'll do that before the end of this episode. Um, oh wow, we have a lot of rocks here. Hmm. Hmm. All right, let's see. Um, let's try building something maybe with Homemaker. Try something a little different on each one, maybe. Maybe. Uh, let's see. Maybe, maybe. Let's see, what do we have? Wood. Walls. Yes and no. That's a big dude. Uh, let's see. Maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Um. Hmm. That's kind of funky. <laughs> that is pretty darn funky. I mean, this technically could work. Gets us some good height, too, because we do have that nasty cliff over there that uh, people could sneak in. You know what? I'm going to use this. This is pretty cool. I'm, I'm, I'm digging this. We just got to put some, some protection in place. So let's... Um, I think back over in the regular wood section is where I saw some, um, yeah, these dudes. Let's see. Getting like that going there. All. <laughs> what else is there? Hey! Oh, I missed it. Alright. Give me that so I can just take it and put it. Nope. Just like that. So that gives us some protection, but I think we're going to have to maybe add to that. 
maybe. Hmm. I'm thinking too, maybe some guard posts at each gate, kind of similar to this or something. We'll figure that out uh, at another time. Let's see, what do we have? Maybe I'll put something else in place instead of railings. Maybe a wall. Um... Half walls. How much taller are these? Ooh, that's even better. All right. Um. All right. Let's oop, and get rid of that. There we go. Now we're actually getting a little protection here. So let's uh put two different ones in place so that this actually looks a little more realistic. Now that, of course, uh, is not enough protection. So we are gonna go to here. And let's see. Oh, it's probably in here. Metal textures. Um. Hmm. No, oh, where am I looking for? Would help if I could see everything. <laughs> Come on, buffer. Come on. Maybe. There we go. Okay. Um. Maybe it wasn't decorative. Looking for some patchwork stuff. I think uh, I'm in the wrong section, probably. Textures. Oh, I guess. Well, no, this is still not really what I'm looking for. Um. No. 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 Wood. Floors. Be junk. All. Come on, move. There we go. Ugh, I hate it when it gets stuck like this. <laughs> um, nah, not really. I know exactly what I'm looking for. I just never remember where the heck it is. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Hmm. And of course, every time I stop, I get stuck. Because it's got a load and buffer all this stuff. Um, yeah. Scrap pieces. Maybe let's try... Oh, not exactly what I was thinking of, but I will take it. Uh, figure something out. We'll put it, like, here on the outside so that it looks like we're actually getting some protection from bullets and whatnot being fired at us. Um... Let's go with yeah one of the, one of these guys. I think it looks a little different. We're gonna stick them on the outside so that we can still see our nice wood on the inside. Um, put one like that, and then we'll kind of overlap these guys because it doesn't quite match up to our corner piece. We'll just kind of finagle this like so, make this look really janky so that it actually looks real. Let me just. Yeah, how's that? That looks pretty good. I want to lower these guys a little. So they don't stick up too, too high. Cool! Oh, jeez, yeah, that guy's got to come in. <laughs> Way too far. Um, nope, now you're just glitching in the opposite direction. Let's see, how does that look? Nope, still glitching. Alright. Now I can actually see you, so let's do that. Let's, uh, come here to the outside and see how that looks. Not bad, but we want something like that. There we go. Now we got some protection. Um. Huh. Where'd the other piece go. Far? Stick you. That there it is. Cool. I mean that sticks out a little bit, but who cares? I mean, I kind of care. So <laughs> let's fix that. Yeah, all right, that works. I mean, obviously, if somebody comes up here, you know, it's still gonna be kind of hard to hide from that. But whatever. I mean, it's still gonna serve its pulpit. Now we need to be able to get up there. Um, I'm thinking, thinking, I'm thinking. Maybe let's bring that back up again. Maybe we'll put like some more. Metal patchwork up there to kind of cover and protect coming up and down the stairs. We'll put one there and 
this little guy can go up here, make it look like we're actually attaching it to the fence. That way when we put our ladders or stairs in place, we have some protection. All right, now we need some ladders or stairs, I should say. Uh, let's try the default wood. Maybe I'm gonna find something. Yeah, that's what I used on the last one, so maybe not. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Um, you know what? Let's try these guys. <laughs> of course, it doesn't snap where it's supposed to. Um, we got that that goes like that. I mean, uh, that kind of works. Not a hundred percent sold on that. Maybe let's try doing a little turn dealy. Let's get that in place. Um, I'm gonna snap one of those in place. Then go back to our stairs. That's gonna be too short. That one kind of works. That's kind of janky looking. <laughs> um, but at the same time, you could always just give multiple ways to get up there just in case. I mean, hmm, I don't know. Kind of on the fence about that one. Uh, well, literally and figuratively. <sighs> don't mind me and my bad jokes. Um, hmm. Yeah, I, uh, I don't know about that one. All right, let's, uh, uh turn off our snapping because that's not going to work. So let's go ahead and put our little bit right there. Got to take that out of the thing. There we go. That's a little better. Now we just have a little bit of a space here. So, um, oh, I need to turn my snapping back on. And, oh, something that big. I don't really need something that big. All right, hang on. Let's, uh, Get a different floor here. Back into wood and wood. Wood floors. Just need a little guy. These little dudes. There we go. And then, alright, let's get rid of that one for now. Oops. Go back into here, 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 R. There we go. That's kind of more of what I was thinking for over here as well. That uh, does kind of look a little better, and we'll put some supports in there as well. And uh, we need some supports here, too. Let's put uh, a couple of these bad boys in place. So that actually looks like it's being held up. And let's see. Do we have any railings in here? Why don't we have railings? Oh, cheese and crackers. All right. Um, yeah, I'm going to get rid of that. And maybe I'll kind of try to do the same thing here. Putting this stupid snap thing here. Um, should, maybe it should or shouldn't come curved like that. Um, Alright, let's put a floor piece in and let's find out. Why not? Let's see how that goes. Alright. And we have no snap. <laughs> Alright. And back over here. Barn, stairs, little guy. That looks pretty cool, I think. All right, let's uh, see if the short ones are long enough. Perfect. I'll put one in each thing. Why not? Get plenty of support. All right. Um, do you have railing? Miscellaneous. You have supports. I kind of like the metal ones a little better. Um, are you tall enough to reach that? You are, sort of. In some spots. I mean, I could just kind of. Put you dead center like that. So we got some support. Looks kind of cool. Um, I have an idea. Let's boop, boop, make you a little bigger. And we'll stick you like so. Cool. Let's do the same thing with this guy here. Boop, boop. Make it bigger. And you have to do the sound effects if you are doing that because it does not work unless you do. And you heard that here first, kids. Nice. 
All right, but well, we still need some railings for that. So, cause safety first, kids. Always safety first. So let's go back here. Let's get some railings. Um, we don't need anything super fancy, so let's put uh, one of those dudes there, and one of those there, so that uh, we break up the monotony. And what you are, and you there. Cool. We have another guard tower with uh, some fancy schmancy steps that we access from either direction because we have two openings here, so of course we need two sets of stairs. Okay, I think we're we're kicking butt here. So, if I do decide to um, put guard posts here, they're not going to be like gigantically tall. Like I will just simply take that section of wall out and put one here on each side. Um... I don't know if I'm going to do that, um... I guess maybe you guys can vote on that one if you want to see me put some, uh... some guard posts on each side of the gate, uh, on both sides. I will do it on both sides if you guys decide you want to see that done. Um, you can never have too many guard posts, and, uh, again, I do have to put one here somewhere in the center as well. Maybe where that guy is right there that, uh, sticks out like a sore thumb. Maybe we'll take him out and, uh, replace him with another one. But that is going to happen in the next episode. So, yes, uh, let me know what you want me to do. If we're going to put some guard posts there, um, there's definitely going to be one going there. And if we should be putting them there as well. And don't forget to keep voting for the bridge idea as well. Just uh, leave comments below. Um, maybe even by now I have uh, decided to put a poll up on Facebook for you guys to vote. Um, yeah, maybe I'll... Uh, do that, and I'll be speaking about this in past tense now, because it's already up, and you should be voting. Um, yeah, maybe I'll do that. I don't know. <laughs> Alright, until next time, everybody, don't get irradiated. <laughs>